Well, 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 what's good, fans of Fight Fans? It's your boy JB, Trap House Boxing. Back again with another video. Shouts out to the whole LDBC. Y'all smash that like, subscribe button. Share the video always and leave your thoughts and comments at the end of the video. And if you're looking for that exclusive street news, go subscribe to Urban Media Fix. Hit that notification icon bell so you miss none of this heat that's been dropped. Also, go subscribe to Fanar International so you can join us every Sunday on OG Boxing Talk. Every Sunday, 9 o'clock a.m. Eastern Standard Time. Hit the notification icon bell so you don't miss it. All right, so let's talk about it, man. So apparently, uh, Dillian White has a very, 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 very strong possibility of fighting on December 7th of, uh, of the, uh, Andrew Ruiz versus Anthony Joshua undercard versus uh, Char Charles Prince Martin. And... Uh, you know, according to the World Boxing News, that that they're saying that basically, you know, just paraphrase, you can go read the article, it's on worldboxingnews.com, um, that they just going to sweep sweep Dylan White, you know, little whole be simple thing up under the rug, you know, if he fight on, on December the 7th. You know, they say it's going to be a strong, strong possibility. They say it went from a possibility to a strong possibility. And, um... Let's talk about that real quick. You know, I, I can recall back when, when Big Baby Miller had to test positive to fight AJ. You know, they went through the whole suspension and the whole nine, you know. And as far as with Dylan White, uh, I don't even, he didn't even get suspended, to be honest with you. They never even took his license or anything, according to my knowledge, that I can remember. You know, um, Eddie Hearn treated big baby miller like he was just a, a peasant on the streets you know turned the shoulder on him talk real bad to him you know made made damage worse than what it already was you know but, but you know looking back at it he might as well have let uh big baby miller fall aj why not i mean you letting dylan white slide through the cracks with you know uh testing dirty and still getting fights you know you could basically just say that Dylan White wasn't, he was still active. He didn't get anything. He didn't get stripped of anything. You know, he's still the WBC mandatory. So what 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 consequences did, did Dylan White suffer? No, same like any. You know, but um, still want to know what's up with that B sample for Dylan White. You know, uh, I, I don't I don't believe he should be getting off the hook that easy. You know, um, but it's just crazy how you see how the sport of boxing going. You know, we got WBC, I guess, apparently uh, making it, made, you know, making it uh, okay to use kombuterol, a certain amount of kombuterol, you know, so it's making it okay for you to cheat. You know, they're coming up with all these belts. You know, I just, I just don't know what's really going on, man. I really don't, I don't know. But as far as this fight, though, I, I like the fight. You know, don't get me wrong, I, I love the fight. This is a, a, a fire fight, a fire ass fight. You know, I'm sure, I'm sure all the fans want to see this fight. Nobody's not upset about this fight. I can guarantee you that. You know, uh, Charles Martin. You know, he can't. He, I don't. I, I, I only watched the Adam Konaki fight. You know, I don't know how many, I don't know how busy he's been since he's been on, he had a, he had a long layoff, long layoff. But uh, he fought uh, AJ, so they got a common opponent. You know, if they do fight, they got a, a common former opponent that they both lost to, which is Anthony Joshua. Um, and, but the thing is, in, in uh, Prince Charles Martin's last uh, album with Adam Kanaka, he, he held a good count of himself, man, you know. It was a lot of times in that fight I thought he was going to check out, but he stayed in there. You know, he uh, got down on his grit, man, and he, he fought hard, you know, fought fought to a tough decision and lost. But, you know, he definitely got my respect out of, you know, in that fight. You know, I already had respect for him before. I just kind of questioned, you know, the way he laid down to AJ. You know, I kind of questioned his heart. But uh, he proved that he still got the heart of a warrior. But the... Uh, the thing about this bout, man, this bout here would be definitely a bloodbath. This bout would definitely be a, a bloodbath. Um, 
And, and the thing is, you got to ask yourself, if these guys was to fight, they probably ain't even, wouldn't even be doing no drug testing for, for Dillian White. I guarantee you they probably wouldn't even be doing no drug testing. You know, um, according to Eddie Hearn, he said that Dillian, before he performed, he had to uh, get a, approval through with the fans and all this other crap. But he automatically, uh, allegedly, about to be put be popping up on the undercard of the Ruiz versus AJ fight, you know. So I don't know, man. I, I don't know. <laughs> I don't know what's going on with this whole little B sample thing. But like I said, I'm not mad at the fight. I'm definitely not mad at the fight. But let's let's talk about. Uh, Let's go ahead and talk about Dillian White since we already, you know, at it. Um, Dillian White had them fought uh, Oscar Rivas last in a tough outing. You know, had a had a, a war. He fought to a, a split decision, which is I thought he lost the fight. Uh, a lot of people thought Dillian White lost the fight, even on the juice, and he got dropped. You know what I mean? The fight before that. Uh, he 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 fought to a, a controversial decision against Joseph Parker. No, he knocked out David Chisora, Derek, Derek Chisora. My bad, he knocked him out. Then the fight before that, he fought to a, a controversial decision with uh, Joseph Parker. Some people thought he lost. Some people thought he won. You know, um, so he has been on the, on the rise, you know, but. You know, the the fans question, you know, was he clean or not? Was Dillian White clean or not? And a lot of people came to the assumption that he was not clean. You know, a lot of people came to the assumption that he's been dirty this whole time. You know. Yeah, we can't prove the priors, but based on based on the uh the recent, you know. Based on the recent that 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 uh draws people to, you know, conclude that uh, he was cheating the whole time. But um, it's going to be interesting to see how they sweep this under the rug and just get away with it. It's very, it's going to be really, really interesting, man. Uh, I want to see how the media, how the media come down on, on like Eddie Hearn and you know, Dylan White, because one thing about it, if this fight does proceed, they definitely going to have to ask some questions, you know, answer some questions, especially if some questions uh, is being asked. You know, I'd be highly upset if, if people out there is not asking these guys the questions, what's up with the beef sample, and, you know, so forth and so forth. How did they pull this out their hat? How did they make, how did he, Dylan White, get on this undercard? How Dylan White did not get suspended? How Dylan White did not get his license taken? The whole nine. The whole nine. You know. Um, but it, I wouldn't be surprised, like I said, this is this is boxing, man. I would not be surprised. But before Charles Martin, man, I, I, I'm, I'm going to be pulling for Charles Martin in this fight. It'll be it'll be interesting to see if, if Charles Martin, if he wins, though, what, what is, I mean... What is what is is he is what is is he what are they fighting for WBC mandatory spot? I mean, what are they fighting for? What is he gaining? You know, because what if what if Dylan White uh what if he be Dylan White and then Dylan White get get stripped or whatever the case may be? So what are, what are they fighting for the mandatory spot or is just for shits and giggles? What what are they fighting for? You know that I don't think they stated what was on the line. You know, but um, but like I said, this would be a tough regular fight. You know what I mean? I, I wouldn't be mad at the fight, but I, I you know, but I, uh, you know, under the circumstances that Dillian White ain't clean, you know, I, I, I want some answers. You know, I definitely want some answers. But you already know what it is, though, man. It's your boy JB Trap House Boxing. What you waiting on? Subscribe to the channel. Like, share the video always. And make sure you hit the notification icon bell so you miss the jab sessions. I'll holler at y'all. Peace out.